Hi, this is Jules for you. And I have a few more rings to show you. We're going to start with the tanzanite. This is a beautiful tanzanite cabochon. Hopefully it'll focus in. There we go. Beautiful, fine silver. I set it up in between so the light comes through this way. Beautiful glow. Cabochon. Let's put it on. Lovely. Just lovely. It's a little big for that finger. Let's put it on that one. Distance. Okay, let's see what size this one is. Okay. Yep, this is about an eight and three quarters, so no wonder why I didn't fit that finger. Eight and three quarters. The next one that we have, it is a hematite. Black stone with the silver finish is what they look like when they're all polished. It's just beautiful. Hematite. Healing stone. Reflective. The band, gorgeous. Fine silver. I hammered that one. And this one goes on my pinky. Beautiful pinky ring. Beautiful, delicate bezel setting. Okay. What else do we have here? How about my buffalo bone face? Buffalo bone with a CZ right here. Just a delicate little CZ. And then all this silver I placed all the way around. Beautiful, beautiful. Yeah. Buffalo bones, so no animals like my favorite elephants got hurt. But people eat buffalo, so I guess that they, they got the bones from that. Let's put it on. Upside down. Distance. Turn it around. There we go. There. Okay, let's see how, what size this one is. Did 
This one is size seven and a half. Seven and a half. Okay, this one is a pink CZ. Kind of a reddish pink with two double bands side by side, fine silver, in a what I call a box setting. So it's sitting down under in the box. Look at that. Beautiful. Oh, it's just beautiful. Yeah, I love that. Anything that sparkles is what I love. Yep. Let's see what size this one is. Oh gosh, that's about seven and three quarters. Okay. This is another molten silver that I made. I love making the free form. Just free form it. Makes it totally original. Nobody has anything like it. I like everything original. It is just beautiful, shiny. Let's see if it'll come in. It's not really coming in, is it? Just be real steady and maybe it'll come in. There we go. <laughs> Took forever. Oh. <clears throat> but see the shape? It's got a very nice, smooth, in and out shape. Almost like a dog right there. <laughs> okay, let me put this on. Too big for my pinky, but it's too small for for my ring finger. Oh yeah, I love the shine. Whoa. Wow. This was beautiful. So let's see what size this one is. Six and a half. Just in between both those pinkers. That's what I deal with. Okay, what we have next is a spinner ring. Let's see if you can hear it spin. There we go. Beautiful spinner ring. Concave. Okay. 
with a rope of silver. size eight. Eight, eight it is. Eight. Well, I really like this one. I think it's just beautiful. Garnets. Three lovely garnets. Kitty, you don't have to do that right now. No, you don't have to do that. the holes in the back so you can see the light through all in fine silver on a shield with my molten lava bone balls I almost said bones balls molten lava silver I call them lava I don't know why anyway it's beautiful. <laughs> he's just gonna, he's just gonna be a pest, aren't you? He's just gonna be a pest. Get pest, mama. He's gonna pest, mama. They like to do that. When you're busy, they want the attention. Just busy, busy, busy. Mama busy, he's like, I'm jealous. I want mama's attention. Well, let's see what size this one is. Perfect size eight. Perfect. Oh, this is gorgeous. Ethiopian opal. That's the Ethiopian. Ethiopian opal. Say that three times. See the beautiful iridescent color. This is opalite. I didn't make any light come through because to me they were as light as can be. I like a little bit more depth so I can see the blue. If we didn't have that, it would be more of a white, clear. I like to see the, the beautiful color of the blue. Look at that. Oh, this is one of my favorites. See what size this one is. <laughs> size seven. I think I made it just for me. I think I did. This one is gorgeous. Now, this one has such beautiful fire to it, but guess what? It's an imitation, but it feels just like a real one. Baltic Amber. 
I love it. The setting is spectacular. Look at that. It's got the scallop around the edge. If this thing would focus. And then it's got leaves on the side. doesn't want to focus. <laughs> Come on. There. <laughs> Don't you love it? Oh my gosh, see the leaves. I put a rope around the edge. The leaves. So pretty. I think it's so delicate, so pretty. See? Just the right outfit and it's just like gorgeous. In fine silver. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Lovely. Mm-hmm. I like it. Let's see what size it is. Oh, it is seven and three quarters. Seven and three quarters. Oh, this one. Shield ring. This one has a real blue sapphire <clears throat> and four garnets. On a beautiful hammered fine silver shield. Got all the holes for the beautiful stones to shine through. Yeah, look at that. Okay, let's put this on. Just the right outfit. Gorgeous. Okay, let's see what size this is. We're looking at seven and a quarter. Last but not least, one of my all-time favorites that I ever made. It was hard to make, but I think it turned out just beautiful. Garnet. Beautiful setting. Like, like princess crown or something. With all the fine silver ropes around and around and around. Double shank, hole in the middle, shows off this beautiful garnet. Oh yeah, look at that glow, cabochon. That is spectacular. One of all time favorite. Oh, yes, let's put it on. Yeah. It's so pretty. Just stays right where it's supposed to, doesn't flip around because of the double shank. Double shanks are absolutely perfect feeling. Mm -hmm. Let's see what size this is. If it's a seven, I can keep it in. 
Oh, well, it'll still fit that finger. It is like a seven and a half. So, okay, I think the double shank makes it a little bit tighter. So, it'll fit you too, I'm sure. I love that. <laughs> okay we're done for today and if you're interested just you know put a like maybe subscribe I've got a lot more rings and I have an Etsy account so if you're interested you can look at my my shop so here's my card Jules Creations Art at etsy.com all right thanks for watching <laughs>